I'd like to introduce you to a website called Issue. Here we go, issuu.com. And this is a website that allows you to turn a regular PDF document into uh, an interactive magazine. So if I just demonstrate by clicking on this magazine here. So this has been uploaded by somebody else. Um, I can uh, I can just click here to just browse through the magazine. I can click here to uh, see it at a larger size. I can also use this um, navigation menu down here in order to look through the magazine. And then if I want to, I can actually go in and see things in greater detail. So I've created my own account um, and I'm now going to go to my library and we can see uh, for want of a better word, my magazines. So these are all things that I've already published. And what I'd like to show you now is how to publish your own document. So I currently have a Word document. It's here. I'm just going to open this up. And the first thing I need to do is to turn it into a PDF. This website only recognizes PDFs, but creating PDFs are very simple. I'm just going to go to File, and I'm going to go to Save As. And then in this drop down menu here, I'm just going to select PDF. And I'm going to save it to my desktop just so that I can find it easily. So I'm just going to hit save. OK, so now um, I've created a PDF document. And you can see here, so this is just the Word document changed into a PDF. There's, there's nothing unusual about it as such. So now I am going to go back to issue and I'm going to upload that. Uh, I'm going to upload the PDF that I've just created. So I'm just going to browse and select this CPD Opportunities PDF. And I'm going to call it CPD Opportunities. And just add this at, uh, at college. Um, Going to put in some keywords here. Um, separate them with a comma. That. And um, then I'm going to select the type of document and I'm going to select manual or resource. Uh, category, I'm going to go for knowledge and resources, language English, the world. Right, now ordinarily I would just click here, upload the file. But what I found in the past is by doing so, it doesn't always load it properly. So I'm going to try this simple upload here. And I'm just simply going to browse for it again. It's going to keep all my other settings. So here we go, CPD opportunities, open and upload. OK, so now that document is simply being uploaded from my desktop to my issue account. OK, and you can see how incredibly quickly that is. So I can't access this right now. It's being converted. But within the within a couple of minutes, I'm going to be able to see the final thing. So um, while that's happening, let's have a look at, should we have a look at, let's go to the, back to the, the home page and we can see what other magazines are going on. So this is also interesting. You can actually see a graph of how many views you've had of your public publication. Um, let's just click on this one here and see what what other people have been doing. So uh, now there is something else that's very interesting as well. Uh, you can you can search. So I'm going to do a search for Barnet, 
and see what else has been uploaded. And what you can see is that Barnet Council have also been using this. Uh, as well as, so it's included stuff from Barnet Council and then also stuff from Barnet College. So I'm going to go back to see how my upload is doing. So I'm going to go back to my library. And here we go. So this is the document that I've just uploaded. I'm going to click open. And click in to read. So I can now click and move around this document like so. Um, and I can also move backwards and forwards. And you can see that uh, even though there aren't many pages to this document, I still have the ability to uh, quickly go through, uh, scroll through using this menu system. Okay, and that is the end of this tutorial.